there was nothing there. I would. I didn't go down far enough. She said. Nice job. Cafeteria. All right, let's see what's going on here. Look at this cute little guy. It is very cute. There's this one spot down in the terrarium meadows where there's always a breeze blowing. It'd be fun to go spin and spin in the wind there. You know if you run in tight circles for a while, you end up spinning in place? I did. Like this. Wait, what? There we go. You guy's freaking out. Oh no. Yeah, some people are not built for that. <laughs> oh no, look, it's your best friend. You would be wise to stay away. I'm a danger to all who approach. Leave me be, okay? No, I'm here to bully you too. Wait, is it even possible? <laughs> are you, are you like me? Yes. Then you must have heard the call. Sir? Yes. What is happening? <laughs> I see. What has called you here then? Oh, frick. I mean, the vibes, I want to say the, the darkness. darkness, but... The darkness. Yes, darkness is good. It quenches the thirst of my pitch black soul. <laughs> you can feel it, right? Me, when it goes in. <laughs> feel the stirring <laughs> of the power in your hand there. Why would you say that about yourself? <laughs> you get roasted. <laughs> they actually probably do eat Pokemon. Um, there is a cow Pokemon, yeah, but not a poke, not a cow that's not a Pokemon. What? There is a there is a Pokemon that's a cow. Yes, but there Mil -tank. are but there are not cows that are not Pokemon. Yeah, there are no normal cows. Uh, to my knowledge. Well, in the TV show, they do drink milk, but they might be they. It, it's, I think I think it's Moo Moo milk is what they call it. For Mil -tank. Yeah, because Mil Tank has just sitting out there with their titties hanging out. And then there's Torchic. The bird? Oh, the chicken. But there's no chickens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where do you feel the stirring? Um, my right hand. Yo, what up? What's up? Welcome. How is your Thursday? No, it's the left hand, the left hand of darkness. Oh, I gotta go through this whole thing again? Oh my gosh. But yeah, Miltank is actually, it's really funny, because in, in Gen 2, there's a Miltank, and this lady, like, you, you crush her, and then she throws out this Miltank, and it just devastates your team. Mm. We're doing good. Rodney had a long day, so she's sleepy. Uh, I'm really sleepy. I had to drive down uh, to Albany, Georgia today for my job, which is three hours from where we live. So six hours of driving today. I was telling Ian, I felt like I fell asleep. I almost fell asleep like three times on the drive back. And like any time I started to feel my eyes close, I was like, turn up the music. Or I was like, D drink some of this, this lemonade I bought or something. Well, like, and it was weird because when you woke up this morning, I was like, she got up really fast. Like, she doesn't seem that tired. Some some days, I'm so tired that I get up fast because I'm like, if I lay here, I might fall back asleep. Yeah. So on the days that I get up fast, that's actually a sign that I'm more tired than on the days where I, like, get, get up a little slower because... Sometimes, you know. Yeah. Can yeah, look I at this just guy. lay here? <laughs> yes, yes, your left hand. I knew you were like me. <laughs> Allow me to teach you my kindred spirit, the sign of twilight. What the heck? The peace pines? The peace pines. He's still my left hand emote from the boy. What emote? I don't remember. Oh, here you go. What's the left hand? Is it the dab? Oh no, is it the one with the exclamation point? That's please. please. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh. Wow. So they won't fall asleep. 
Because if you had that base value, you wouldn't want to take a little nap nap. Oh. Don't the dial! I haven't seen you in a while. The grass eats you? That's cool. If you're just like, you know what? I'm just gonna go lay in the grass. I'm really <laughs> struggling with my uh, sleeping habits. I'm just gonna go lay in this grass, yeah. Welcome! All our goods can be bought with berry points. Oh, but we need these for upgrades. Yeah. We gotta get the 3,000 for some of them. Yeah. Goodbye, don't ever talk to me again. To the cafeteria. Date time! Date time with Toothpaste Boy. He, he does kinda... It sounds like a isekai. His hair does look like toothpaste. You know, like, I, became, I traveled to another dimension and brushed the boy's teeth. <laughs> Yeah. We should get more in the easy guy. Should we? Yep. Welcome! Just let me know what you like and I'll dish some right up for ya. Oh. This looks a horrendous. Deep dish pizza. That looks like I would get a stomach ache when I ate it. The Academy special is so much food. This is what we get when we go to the Korean fried chicken place we go to. Yeah. And we're like, we're so hungry. And at the end, we're like, oh. I can't eat anymore. Power up these foods. Carnivorous grass is such an interesting idea because I would be terrified to go outside at any point. Mm. Bum, 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 bum. They got like meatballs on this pizza. Oh yeah. You're little. You were like. <laughs> that looks so good. Yeah. Good luck with your studies, okay? Alright. Daytime. Now we're full. Hey. hey, Ian. No need to stand there. Grab a seat. This boy has toothpaste for hair. Here's the Drayster's take. The Academy Special is the best thing on the menu. It's all soft, so you basically just gulp it down. Barely even need to chew. <laughs> That's what I'm looking for in my food. Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> Chew your food, Drayton. You and my ma would get along. So listen, your Pokemon are pretty strong, yeah? With a team like that, you've got a shot at becoming the BB League champion. Wouldn't that be wild, an exchange student just rolling up here and snatching the crown? Um... Oh, so it's kind of like how in The Witcher, like, humans showed up later and elves already had a civilization there. So That's like, a, I, yeah, the hair, the toothpaste hair. Yeah. I was just thinking of like in Fanghorn Forest. Yeah, where yeah. Where the trees like. They're like that. Why would the trees have friends when they've never been friends? Yeah. What, what the heck does he say? It be something like that. Yeah. I'm too tired to remember right now, but I want to see you join the BB League. And you in? Uh, sure. All. Look who's decided to grace us with their presence. Oh god, it's all the characters I they got. It, why do you have a frag band? They're about to kill me. They're Whoa, good. it's the champion. It's, it's Tangled style. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's it. It's on nobody's side. Because nobody is on our side. We have just finished saying hello. <laughs> Good, good morning. But <laughs> well, it's night time yeah, already! <laughs> <laughs> and the rest of our Elite Four, too. What do you want to talk to me about? Nothing special. Just thought we could grab a bite. We better to do that than the cafeteria. What a waste of time. You got so much time to goof off, why don't you go train your Pokemon? You think maybe this is why you always lose to me? I'll take that as no. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't swing a lunch date with you, even if I got your old pal with me. <laughs> Look at that, your smile. <laughs> huh, Ian? Long time no see. W why? You didn't hear he was coming to study abroad here? For real? Yep. Okay. Yes, yes it's, it's true. true. Oh yeah, you do her. Director Serrano himself 
introduced himself to me when we met at the school. I think it's Chirano because like Ch- I was thinking Cyrano. Because well, I'm thinking in Wales, like they spelled their country as Chimaru and it's mm. C Y. Looks directly to the camera like the office. We're already tight, us two. In fact, I was just asking Ian to join the BB League. Ooh, I like that. That'd be fire. Get out of here, Natsu. He looks like the main character from Dreamland. What? A student from another school joining the BB League. Unprecedented. That, that's right. Uh, Ian may be wonderfully capable in battle, but that doesn't mean he belongs in the BB League. I took a bath with Epsom salt earlier, and I just found the piece like stuck in my skin. Honestly, these these this fa- flora flora not yeah. fauna. This sounds like great things to include if you're making like a fey themed D and D game, and you're like the players are like, "Well, you found a beautiful willow to rest by for the night. Does everybody go to sleep?" And you're like, "Yeah," and then it's like you wake up, you're halfway inside of the trunk of a tree, <laughs> and it has teeth, and it's trying to it, eat you. It <laughs> and you're like, ah. <laughs> it's on your screen. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, come on. Do you all hate fun and friendship or something? You want to exclude someone who's taking our same classes and living in our same dorms? You know what, Toothpaste Kid? You're alright. I was like, Drayton seems kind of cool, honestly. Yeah. I don't know why people are hating on him. How is he not one of us? Isn't this place supposed to be all about students having autonomy? A stream that makes you want to drink, but turns out everyone that do- does turns into fish because humans killed all the fish and it wants more. <laughs> it kind of sounds cool. like the the tree from the Name of the Wind, or not the Name of the Wind. The what's the sequel called? Wise Men's the Fear. Wise Men's Fear. Kinda. Evil tree. Yeah. I think we should vote on it. I mean, yes, obviously. How about you, Lacey? I'm sorry, but considering the rules, it's a no for me. Lacey, you damn turn How dare you? I thought we were friends. His name's Crispin? Crispin. Huh? Yeah, why not? He's another school. That makes him a student like us, right? How about you, Amorous? What do you say? I abide by the rules of this institution. Proposition declined. Two against two, huh? Hey, that's me. Alright then. What says the reigning BB League champion, our mighty Kieran? doesn't matter who I'm facing. I don't lose. Every time he talks, I hear the, the, the I was born this way opening. It doesn't matter if I'm capital whatever. Cap- you, know, you know what I'm talking about? Lady Gaga has that monologue. No. Little blobs? What little blobs? How a little blobs? Hold on, let me look up these lyrics. Born this way lyrics. Oh yeah, it doesn't matter if you love him or capital H-I-M. Just put your paws up, because you were born this way, baby. But the way she delivers it is like the same cadence you re- you're reading here oh, in. God. Huh, guess we've got our answer. Hmm. Oh, the floating blobs in the background? I can't remember that Pokemon oh. name. Oh, yeah. I don't remember their name. That is a Pokemon. I yeah, yeah. Trayton, manipulating people to get what you want is just not right. He didn't really manipulate him. He just, he literally, just asked, asked literally asked him if he wanted to let him join. Crispin. Uh, I don't know. Because it'll be... I, I have never seen a role where Pedro Pascal plays with his face. Like, I've only seen him in The Mandalorian when he's wearing the mask. So I'll be interested to see what he's like. I mean, I have liked him in everything I've seen him in, because he was in Game of Thrones, then he was in The Last of Us the TV show. He was show. in Game of Thrones? Who was he? Uh, he plays a lord from one of the southern countries that comes... Uh, he's in, like, the later seasons. He, he gets killed yeah. the same season he arrives. He's only in one season, but he was really good. Yeah, he. I loved his character in Game of Thrones, but classic Game of Thrones fashions, he had to die because he yeah. was a likable character. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, he, it, he died. Yeah, I'm, I'm interested to see how they do it, 
But a lot of people I saw were saying that like when they announced it, they released like a Valentine's Day card with the, the Fantastic Four and they like photoshopped them into it. Mm. And they were like, even like the tone of the Valentine's Day card fits the comics. Like it seems like they really fit the mood. Interesting. Um, Two other characters make the Mando Oh, character. Grogu and... I think who the other one would be. Yeah, who else is in that? Because now it's all crossing over, so my brain's like, Sabine? Maybe, uh, what the hell is her name? She's sitting in the chair. Um, she's in the Clone Wars TV show. Soka? No, the Mandalorian lady. I don't know. Oh, the Smith lady? Yeah. Or, no, uh, no, not the Smith. She's the one that... Oh, I know who you're talking about. Oh, what the hell is her I name? I about. The uh, red hair? Yeah, yeah. Mmm. Oh, really? He isn't in the suit? He, well, he, I think he was at first, but then he stopped because he's too busy filming other stuff. Interesting. Yeah. Um. What is her name? Her name is Elizabeth Sachs in real life or well, something like that. Well, yeah, but I mean the character name. Katie Sachs. Um. Bo-Katan. Bo-Katan! I remember yeah, that. Yeah, Bo-Katan Kreese. See, that, that's how tired I am. It took me that long to think of that. <laughs> From the time you yeah. asked the question, it was processing. Because she's probably the coolest character in the series, except for I Grogu. Like but Grogu is just funny. Just eating mm. little things. Guess she'll be joining the BB League, huh? Baby League. Well, let's look on the bright side. Maybe you and Kieran will come out of this better friends. Maybe. I'll be right behind you every step of the way. But now that the decision's been made, we better get you officially signed up. Meet me at the reception desk in the school's entrance area. Okay. He's like, you want another pizza? <laughs> yeah, what, what, what are your guys' names back here? I don't remember. Yeah, I don't know how some of these characters get their hair to be like Talk that. Talking about him. No, no, toothpaste boy. Oh yeah. Okay, wait for us. Let's go. Let's go see her in her dorm room. Mm -hmm. See if we can get a little smooch. She's not even here. This plush Dunsparce looks deeply relaxing. Look at this sick ass boy picture. Does she just have a bunch of snacks sitting on her counter in the kitchen? She still looks like she has a bunch of chocolate bars. Chocolate <laughs> treats are lined up here. She's not even here. She told us to come join her and then she she wasn't even there. Yeah. Alright. Continue the plot. Oh, it's time. It's dinner time. It's kitty dinner time? Oh, it's past kitty dinner it's time. It's past kitty dinner time. I might need a second dinner. Mohawks and Liberty Spikes and long hair. Use mustache wax and surfboard wax. Dang. Yeah, I I always remember what, like when you watch like old punk videos, you're like, holy crap, how did you get your hair to stay like that? This is that. There you are. This is where you can get signed up for the BB League. Can I help you? I want to join the BB League. He's hacking. You're not. You're an, that you're an exchange student, which means you're not technically enrolled here at our academy. Don't mind that. We elite four talked it over real quick. My friend here is good to join. Hi, right, doing. I don't mean to sound rude, but I'm not sure if I can take what you say at face value, Drayton. No, he's telling the truth. I'm allowing Ian to join the BB League. Yes, champion, one moment, please. The, the staff is like, he's the champion. Didn't expect you to ride up in shining armor and save the day. I've got a feeling you're trying to play Puppet Master. But if I get a shot at battling Ian, then that's fine with me. That's just peachy. Ian. You better not go losing to anyone until our battle. 
like I lose. Whoa, that's a deeply concerning face. This is the face you see when you like, you wake up at 3 a.m., you're bleary eyed, you gotta pee, you stumble into the bathroom and flick the lights and this face is behind you in the mirror. Good. I'm not a little kid anymore, and you know what? When I show you how the best of the best battle... Kiki, you shouldn't talk to Ian like that. Shut it, sis. Looking forward to seeing you climb the ranks. I'm sorry, Ian. Kiki was really acting out, wasn't he? Man, such an attitude. Well, he's Mr. Big Deal Mighty Champion, after all. Trayton, you're the one who dragged Ian into all this BB League drama, aren't you? Me? No way, this was all his idea. Right, Ian? Nah, man. No doubt about it. Hear that, Carmen? He's hungry for action. I don't know, I think something fishy's going on. But if you're gonna do this, you might as well do your best. I'll be cheering for you. And please keep an eye on Kiki for me. We are entered. Great timing. Clear to compete in the BB League. You've got recommendations from several Elite Four members and Director Chirano. You'll start from a higher rank. Chall You'll skip straight to challenging the Elite Four at their respective bases once you clear the trials, that is. Okay, so... Amaris is probably going to be the big problem. Steel type? Yeah. Challenge your Leaf 4, you need BP, which you can earn by doing BBQs. Defeat all four of them, you can challenge the champion. You start with whichever one of us you want, your call. If you want to battle one of us, you have to do a fun little trial we cooked up first. Sound good, right? Okay. Take me to the terrarium, baby. Let's do it. Meow. Start All right. you so far back. Yeah. I, you know, I wish I would just start being here. So there probably is one in each biome, yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah. Well, fire type. He's right here. He's rank five. Whatever that means. Well, there's the four of them in the league champion. Oh, so he's the lowest. Good. They're fun. I uh, not Ian. <laughs> Gizmo is eating, as I about to say. Ian's eating some of the kitty food. <laughs> Oh! I'm running over all these eggs. God, I'm trying to save my points so I can fight the gym leader. I'll stop him from crisping you up. He's gonna fry you up in a pan. What is it? Amul amulet? I want... You, one of the skills I want to get good at... I think I'm like a be above... For your general male, I think I'm a better than average cook. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, I want to learn how to make a French omelet correctly. Oh, I'd be down for that. I like omelets. So when you roll them up. Yeah. But. Do you put anything in a French omelet or is it just an egg? I don't know. Are you just an egg? Would you love me if I was an egg? Would you egg me if I was loved? Same boy, the tiny child. Welcome to the Savannah Plaza, we're the team that supports Crispin of the Elite Four. And you're Ian, right? We're the BB League's champions. A Dutch baby. What's my that? my mom makes Dutch babies. They're like a well, I mean Keely, are they they're like a thicker pancake, right? Am I thinking of the right thing? Or maybe pancake is not the right word, but some but like that. I just wanna look it up. Oh here I'll, the I'll Dutch pull up the laptop. Baby. Oh, so it's like a concave 
pancake with stuff inside. Interesting. That I looks... think I think my mom puts powdered sugar on hers. Yeah. And does that. Okay. You need to hand over 50 BP. You ready? I'm ready. Big fluffy pancake thing. Technically not a pancake. It's like how a crepe is technically not a pancake. Mm. Thank you very much. Duly received and noted. Hey, Crispin, an order's just coming for you. Coming right up. Oh, hey, I saw you in the cafeteria. You're Ian, right? You voted for me! Just a person to get my energy pumping. I hear I feel like I'm cooking at a nice simmer over here. We gotta move somewhere else for this next part. Follow me. Big boy. Mm -hmm. We're waiting for a fiery challenger like you. Taking on the Elite Four is pretty much right after coming to our school. Now that's lit. That's lit, baby. No wondering Kieran and Drayton like you. And if I'm being honest, you've kindled my curiosity too. You should warn you though, my trial is no cakewalk. My Elite Four trial is putting together a super spicy sandwich. And I mean super spicy. I want something so hot it'll have me breathing flames. either of us burn food or anything that often or mess up? Yeah. I'm trying to think of anything. I don't think so. We don't really... I always... I think the things I always feel bad about is I'm like, Ron, yeah, I want to record a video and she's like, I'm reading and I'm like... I'm... I have other things to do, okay? I know. <laughs> That's why I feel bad bothering you about it. <laughs> and Ronnie's just like, I'm gonna break every glass we own. That's no. our, those are our two problems. I'm just clumsy. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. That sounds easy, right? But you can't use your own ingredients. You have to negotiate with the lead club members around here to get what you need. Who's able to write ingredients? Come talk to me. Then I'll judge your sandwich making skills with my own two eyes. Keep the cooking any dish is picking the right ingredients. The rest is easy as pie. So my sister, for like my entire life, thought she didn't like bacon because my dad overcooks everything. Mm. But I'm also like, I like my bacon, uh, floppy. What's the word? Yeah, I guess floppy. I like it crispy. I'm not a crispy bacon guy. I won't say no to crispy bacon, but I prefer it the other way. Let's do it. Sweet, give me a hot minute to get everything set up. I do think I like more extreme flavors in Ronnie when it's not spice. So, like, I'll put more lemon or, like, more lime or more pineapple and stuff. Negotiate with the club members to get some ingredients. You need to make a super spicy sandwich. That should be a clue for what you need. Okay. What does this have to do with Pokemon battling? Uh, he's fire type. Potato salad. That doesn't sound very spicy. Nah. Here, okay. What? I said that doesn't sound spicy, and then you're battling her anyway. I mean, uh, why not? I'm just gonna get the ingredient. Mmm. I. Yeah. Like... So, I don't know. This might be a controversial take, but before I moved in with Ian. And I did this. I I do this because this is how we did it in my family for like my whole life. The primary way I would cook bacon is to microwave it. I microwave weird. it, and it gets crispy, and then you put it on like the paper towels so it takes the grease off and gets extra like crispy. But uh, since living, I don't eat bacon that often either. I mean, you don't anymore either. You used to eat it like every other day. Yeah, you know? yeah. So, but you always cooked it in the pan. Yeah. So then anytime I cooked it, I, I would just cook it in the pan. I cannot imagine cooking bacon in a microwave. I mean, I you could probably cook it for less time and still get floppy bacon in the microwave. Yeah, but it's not right. Right. It's, it's a sin. God did not make bacon to be made in a microwave. 
Yeah, but then a pan doesn't get dirty, so I don't have to clean a pan. She really hates doing dishes. I hate dishes so much. <laughs> I don't mind doing them. I could not, you know, like, I, I'm, well, and I think I also, I'm not big on leftovers either, so I don't even like microwaving like those. I used to, when I was going into the office at work every day, sometimes I would bring in eggs to microwave in, in the, for like my breakfast. But now that I'm only going in two days a week, I, I'm like, I can go to the cafeteria and get yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Get him, Zebra Strike. Give me your potato salad. <laughs> yes, I can hear the voice of the potato salad speaking to me now. See, we have a dishwasher, but I don't like using it. I would rather do them by hand, but we don't have a good drying space for a lot of dishes. Mm. I took him forever to level up. There he is. Well, it looks like fangs and claws are actually crystallized poison that will afflict you at a mere touch, so don't get too close. I'm looking at Luna just going. Gizmo sitting where they knocked the slime off. My potato salad says it wants to go with you. It did it? <laughs> Girl loves potato Oh, she salad. healed me. Oh, see, I recently bought some of those, like, storage containers, and I just packed up a bunch of, like, it's like high school track gear and stuff, so now I have a lot more closet space. I want some eggs. Got, I've got egg salad. Tr tr uh, chorizo? That's spicy. Alright, I gotta find some eggs. Marmalade and mustard, trade you a jalapeno. Chili sauce or ketchup? Cucumbers. Three ingredients if you bring the right answer. Eggs, oil, and vinegar. <laughs> There's only one answer! Well, do we give him the potato salad? That's not right! Maybe we can only answer something that we've gotten? Oh, mayonnaise! That's what you get when you mix those things! Oh. That, no wonder that's I what don't mayonnaise know, is made out of. I hate mayonnaise. Yeah. Was that so Sun and Moon when you made the... What the heck was it called? The Hawaiian dish? Oh no, wait, Sword and Shield. Curry? Cur yeah, it's Curry and Sword and Shield. And Sun and Moon is something weird. I can't remember what it's called. Oh, I don't know. Okay. The lions are coming to get ya. Just a couple. I don't mind the cooking mini games, it's just that there's not enough variation in them. That was probably Sword and Shield, because that's England. I think so, I think that was one. Let me see what it was called in Sun and Moon. Um, Sun and Moon cooking. Pokemon. Malasadas. Hmm. Um, finish this dweebus off. <sighs> Sword and Shield had a lot of potential. 
Yeah, we played The Sims, Sims 3. 3? Yeah. 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 It's been a while. Not but. for a while, but yeah. I played like every variation of The Sims that has ever existed. Um. Sword and Shield had a lot of. Uh. What's it called? Potential, but they just didn't live up to it. Everyone's asleep. This thing is just using yawn over and over again. Okay, we got him. I love when Luna sits on the remote like that. She, like, if, when I put my phone, when I plug it in and put it on the table, she sleeps on my phone. Probably warm. I mayo underestimated you. I also wonder if she's like, this is the thing that they always carry around with them, so I'm like, gonna protect it. Maybe. Some mayonnaise is really good, so spread the word. Urdu or Hindi? Wait, what? For... For... Wait, what did you say? I don't remember. Oh, okay. <laughs> what, what about Urdu or Hindi? This guy wants potato salad. Oh! Maybe Hindi? Um... Let me, uh, let me do this. Is some Hindi really the quick. language? Remember, we saw the horror movie where she's like from India, right? They speak. Is that Hindi there? Uh, I don't know. Because culturally, that was a very interesting movie, which is why I'm leaning towards that. I mean, honestly, I, it would be between which one, because those are both languages primarily in India. So, whichever one would be more widespread, like who would speak more of which, right? Yeah. What is the one that I would pick? Yeah, I think, I guess, Hindi, just off the top of my head. Egg, cruet of olive oil, and a cruet of vinegar. What did you want? Cucumber. I think I have that now. We want the chili sauce. You even slice the cucumber for me? Okay. What did, what did they want? I don't remember. Eggs. There you go, chum. Jalapeno. Yeah, I guess jalapeno. And then, and then mustard? mustard? Some prosciutto and olive oil. There yeah. you go! Oh. So what, some of the people give you three items if you mm. give them the one. Marmalade and mustard. I mean, of the two, mustard's the spicy one, Yeah, right? I mean, vinegar could add to spice, too. I love vinegar. True. Chorizo? Or chorizo? I think chorizo... Uh, oh wait, hold on, there's somebody behind the rock. Uh, is chorizo raw? Oh, this guy's got jalapeno too. Yeah, extra jalapenos. Do we need more? I don't know, I'm gonna get some extra jalapeno. Yeah, pork sausage. Chorizo is really good. It's I, delicious. I love chorizo. There is this chorizo that we get at our like local little grocery store, and it goes crazy. I think it's just um, <clears throat> not raw. What's the word? The well, I guess smoked. Cured. Yeah, cured. Yeah. So maybe yeah, I guess raw. It's fucking raw. It's raw, you donkey. Oh, I see you. I think my mom sent another picture of cats. It's... Yeah, Ronnie's parents got some kitties. Some babies. 
Peter with one of the cats. Alright, we gotta start taking out this Torkoal. Uh, Nepence, you keep working on Bioplume. Conquer! It's so good! Classic game. I love peeing on the corpses of I, the enemy. I think of that game all the time because that is the game that I got in trouble for playing or watching my dad play. Because my mom was like, I can't believe you're letting her. I, I mean, I was pretty young at the time. Yeah, yeah. Not like that young, though. I think I was like 12 or 13. Work on this Torkoal some more. I love Conquer. Hi. The voice actor for Conquer. How how the heck does Conquer have voice acting, but Pokemon doesn't? Right. Okay, we got rid of the Tortle. <laughs> How dare you attack my crocodile or alligator, whatever he is. Yeah, but they, like nobody is voiced in Pokemon. Yeah, like they, they have never done like the background voice actors and stuff. And then there's an actual article with the head of Game Freak who was like, it would take too long to do language localization for all these different countries and stuff. Which just isn't a fair, you know, like it's not like even Larian, who's not like a massive company at the time, did that. Yeah. And like I get it, like like Link is a non-speaking character. All the heroes in Dragon Quest, but like even Dragon Quest, like background characters had voice acting at least a little bit. Hmm. The whole lot of pain, yo. What a burn. Like, it's honestly, I think it's because Pokemon has a model where every year at Christmas time a new Pokemon has to be coming out, right? So they don't give them three years to develop a game where they could make something really good. Mm-hmm. Okay, I think we have everything now? I think so. Alright. Got everything you need. Want to start making a super spicy sandwich? Okay, you're cooking at high heat. Looking forward to something extra spicy then. Can we have onion. I guess. Double jalapeno. Double. Yeah, do it. Well, that's my thing is like like I I appreciate the ability to make your own character, but like I would never make a character on a solo playthrough because I would want to hear the dialogue of people interacting with whoever you chose. Well, I think even if you do an origin run, I don't think they talk. Like if you played as Gal, I don't think Gal talks when you select his mm. voice options. Okay, I might be wrong, but the videos that I've seen, it looks like they are still silent. So it's only. Uh, the other parts that are voice acted. Do we need to use all? Of I'm not the, gonna uh... use the mayonnaise because that would cut it. Yeah. That would make it less spicy, right? I, I guess. Fiery pick. Like. You know, if the cooking mechanics were a little more interesting, right? I should put them all in one spot so all of a sudden he gets a super spicy bite. That first bite... You do have another tray of them, so... <laughs> you want a little wiener sticking out of your sausage? 
This is sandwich. how I want to eat the my hot dog. <laughs> like this. More jalapeno, more. Alright, I think that's lined up. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I feel like you always put it a little too far back, so maybe go up a little bit. Oh, that's pretty good, right? I had already, like, un like pulled myself back. Yeah. Look at that, baby. Yep, look at that. Better be spicy. Um, me either. Matt Smith is in either. one, and everyone said they were really bad. But I love Matt Smith. I haven't, I haven't seen them either. Yeah. I also remember that Sarah Connor TV show, which I thought was pretty okay when I watched it, but it got canceled after like one season. Flaming hot. A tasty Ian original. Made with Ian's secret sauce. <laughs> oh. Woo! This isn't spicy anymore, it's just pain. I'm burning up all the way inside. Even the spiciest of souls would love that super spicy sandwich. That reminds me, we've got more delicious in Dungeon. Mm. So you know what? I think I can already give you my verdict. You pass. That was absolutely perfect. Your sandwich brought the heat like nothing else. Alright. Now we just gotta beat his... What the heck is that called? Magnator or something? I don't know what that one's called. Hold on, it might be in the decks. I'm gonna enjoy the Mag tinkle mortar. on my tongue as we head back to the plaza. Magmore. Mortar. Magmortar. Magmama. Because it shoots fiery mortars at you, maybe. Well, it's not- the thing for me is it's not just one movie, it was like everyone was like, this movie doesn't make any sense. And then they were like, that movie didn't make any sense. I mean, I definitely feel that, like, I'm not gonna necessarily judge a movie by, yeah. like, everybody being like, it sucked. You know, and it said, watch it for myself and it's, see if I like it. It's just for me, like, if I'm gonna go to the theater, I'm gonna go see, like, a Best Picture nominee, right? Or like if you want like like if we want to go see like a superhero movie, I want something where the special effects matter, which like Terminator does. I think I was in college when the first new Terminators came out, so I was just like, I'm too busy. <laughs> if you think I saw some clips of the fight scenes in the new Marvels movie, and they actually look pretty cool, so I was like, oh, I think that's on streaming now. They actually put some some work into this. Yeah, that one I think is one of those ones that just got. It it is unfairly you just maligned. Have superhero fatigue, right and now. superhero fatigue. Yeah. Well, that wraps up the trial. Time to face me in elite battle. You all prepped and ready to take me on. Like I think tomorrow. Are you prepped for him. I am. <laughs> I don't think you wanna. Wa you don't have to watch with me, but I think I might watch Maestro. What's that one? That's the Bradley Cooper Best Picture nominee. Oh, where he's... yeah, I'm probably not gonna watch it with you. Yeah. Gizmo snoring again. Yeah. I just realized she paused my laptop and she walked over it. Yeah, and I, like, I feel, I always say I'm like a bad movie critic because like, if I go to a movie and I'm like, that was, that was, I was entertained during it. I'm like, that was a good movie. You know, like, I don't walk away and I'm like, that sucks. Usually, usually I'm like, I don't know. I enjoyed it. I want, see, when I see a movie for me, I'm like. I want dialogue and drama. Like, Zone of Interest. Like, Keely, you would probably hate that movie. I loved it. Movie's incredible. It. I actually don't think it's my choice for Best Picture, though. Based on what I've seen so far, I think it's Anatomy of a Fall. Because mm. I think that one is more contemporarily cognizant of, like, misinformation and, mm. you know, multiple truths being true at the same time and stuff. Mm -hmm. Come right up, watch out, because I'm cranking up the heat. But yeah, like if I'm gonna, like you know when we went to see Shang Chi, I was just like hell yeah, this is just a sick movie. Mm -hmm. So Ian, I take it there's some messy history between you and Kieran, and it sure seems like Drayton's cooking up something fishy too. 
everything's getting so complicated. Why'd you have to go and make things so complicated? She's going on tour, Avril. Oh, really? Yeah. Does she have a new album? I don't know. Oh. If you want to say something, just say it. If you want to do something, just do it. I'm not the kind of guy who wastes time for the small stuff. Oh, the... Wait, what? His dad's actor killed that role. I what are we know. talking about? <laughs> I don't know. A dad to be able to fall? The hot guy? The hot lawyer? I battle because I want to battle. Oh, Shang-Chi! Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh um, yeah. I, I battled because I wanted to battle, you know, that's how it should be. Yeah, that was just a solid movie. I actually think... Is that Aquafina? Mm -hmm. Like, her character... It grows on you, but I was like, someone's gotta get this lady under control. <laughs> um... And I'm like, I think Marvel's doing it again, right? Where they're trying to play this long con game of when characters are gonna show up again. But, like, Shang-Chi has not shown up in a Marvel movie since then, has he? Mm, I, not to my knowledge. So, like, know. like, what are you doing? Like, right? <laughs> I want to win, so that's exactly what I'll do. Oh, boy. Pretty sick. Now then, time to get cooking. Wait, no time to start battling. I do like Talonflame. Yeah? Talonflame is really fast, I think. You're also boosting Makes my sense. moves. Ow! You hurt my baby. We missed. It's too fast for you. Oh. Keep right, it well. going. I wake you up. <laughs> the hell? How did you even do that? You're drinking out of a straw. <laughs> I like the straw wasn't all the way in my mouth. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> You're really gonna douse our flames if you keep using moves like that. <laughs> yeah, Ronnie, you're gonna douse our flames. I'm so tired, I can't even drink out of a straw properly. <laughs> At least it didn't go in my nose. I was so confused because I was like, liquid flew everywhere, but she has a straw in her mouth. <laughs> You like when the kids have the missing tooth and they're like, uh -huh. and it like shoots out? Yeah. No, stop using protect, you jerk. Stop using protect. Okay. Here, muck. <laughs> oh, they're too low level. Oh, I see. There we go. I'm so confused. What's happening? I don't know. Maybe you have to hit battle or something. Oh, I have to choose a. You have move to choose for something you. for the other one. Um, the camera movement. That's fair. I mean, I think that's one of the things that they updated when they switched to the new, new Sims, Sims 4. I don't re 
remember. I played it a lot with my sister, but... Yeah, it's very dark. If you don't have windows, uh, it just is like blackness. <laughs> to see what sims is gonna turn into in the future or if another company is gonna make something that's like like similar because the sims just haven't released a new new game yeah they just keep releasing um like patches which is fine but i would like to see like a brand new game you know hi ghastly Just a cursor out of the side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're like, what the heck? That guy's rocky helmet is annoying, and this is bad. Alright, you're in trouble. Yep. You could give Ogre Pond. I don't think you can do it now, but if you did it before the battle, give them the water mask. At least that's something. Yeah. Because it would be strong against the fire types, right? Are they using... Yeah, you're right. I mean, if you die. So... Right now, Ogre Pond is gonna get lit up because he's grass type, but... Yeah, yeah. Well, the big problem is that... The Rotom... has a Rocky Helmet on. Mm. Oh, I see. That's how Diablo is, and Diablo does it really well too. So top-down like isometric action games are are underappreciated, I think. Now they used to be like everything, you know. It's a pride grammar. All right, there you go. You got one down. It's so tough. Yeah, why is this little uh little rotom so strong? Stop lighting us on fire, you jerk! Oh, goodbye, Ogre Pond. No, oh, he held on! I could choose moves and do that. Mm. A couple shiny Pokemon of different kinds, and they all suck. They have tidy attack, health, and everything. What what were the shinies? Pokemon is so interesting because you really like can go crazy on the breeding if you want to. Like you could just beat the game if you just wanna, you know, do what I'm doing. But people get really competitive with that with like mm. stats and everything. Just me, me. Yep. Yeah, another one? I thought that was the last one. 
Oh no. I thought he only had one left. No, guess not. Where is my herbs? There they are. They keep walking over my keyboard. Damn gremlins. I guess he did not terrestrialize, that is true. Mm. Nice. Hey, that's pretty good. Cause like, their personalities matter for their stats and stuff, it gets crazy. <sighs> the sunlight turned harsh. do as much damage as we can with our level 100. Because, mm. like, this team like I'm using right now is not supposed to win this kind of battle, but I'm just brute forcing it. Mm -hmm. You know? I don't know. I haven't really cared about Pokemon stats, like, since Gen 3 or 4. Crispin's kicking your ass. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crappy ones. <sighs> oh wait, are we talking about Pokemon Go? Cause yeah, Pokemon Go is like almost a different game. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the stats in Pokemon Go are crazy, too. Like, you have to assess them and stuff. And there's, like, such a... a meta for it. Well, probably the end. I do have this useless grabber in my party. Yeah, you could maybe put your penguin back in and put the... Yeah. Yeah, my bed is calling me. It's been calling me since, like, 6.30 this morning when I first got up. <laughs> yeah, whatever. I've Just kill me so I call. can change my team. <sighs> but this is why... For me, Pokemon games have become slightly boring because this, like... Well, you could also... I know you don't want to do it, but, like, you could also look at the TMs and see if there's any more useful moves you can teach so that, like, Ghastly doesn't have all ghosts. Yes, like, but... You could give Ghastly some... That That's not... I mean, yes, but that's not where I was going. I mean, oh. like, I want a little... If, if I can't auto-battle... Like in Dragon Quest, I want to be able to dodge. Like I want to have to be involved in the fight. Um, but yeah. Out of here. Useless pride muck. Yeah, where's the, I don't know. Well, you don't have to put that penguin in, but that <laughs> that's my thought. Sorry. Yeah. Because we also did get this. Um. Zero sixty one. Sixty. This is all low level because I don't usually use water type Pokemon. Sixty three. Mm. B boy, level seventy one. And then you can give that mask to Ogre Pond. But how do I do that? Uh, give an item, and then it's probably under this one, maybe. 
Oh, no, no. It probably would be with the stuff. The other stuff that they can hold. Yep. Oh, no. Oh, that's the ball. Sorry. No. Not that one. Not that one. Yes? There's the wellspring map. Yeah, that's the one. He's transforming! Okay, and then... Yeah. Alright. Oh, I should've changed my order. True. Yellow is your favorite. You love breeding and gold, gold and silver. silver. I love the breeding. Not sure I'd actually like that old school style of visuals, everything anymore. That, yeah, I, I kind of agree with that. I, I, as I said about myself, I do think I'm kind of a graphic snob. So, like, you are always trying to get me to play Dragon's Dogma, and I'm like, I don't. Or, no, not Dragon's Dogma, sorry, what's the one? Legend of the Dragoon. Legend of the Dragoon, and I'm like, that. I don't know if I can do it, you know? Like... <laughs> yeah, I agree. My problem with Pokemon, like I said, isn't... I mean, like, they, there's a lot of stuff I would change. I don't feel like they've gone, like, gold, or red, blue, yellow, gold, silver, black and white... They had plots with some, like, teeth in them. Like, the, even though, like, it was old-looking, they had some dark elements to it. They've really gone, like, disney kidified, and it kind of is ruining the story a little bit. Mm. Because, like, even the old seasons were kind of fucked up. Mm. Like, I just want- I want the story to be more intense. The shiny plastic graphics. <laughs> it's right in that middle age of like 2000 to 2010 where games can either look like, you're like, this isn't too bad, or you're like, this came out in the 2000s. Mmm. You think it freaks him out? Fair enough. <laughs> I was like, who do you want to get rid of more? Wow. He sniped you on site. Might be worth looking into the XP candies, too. Yeah, but we used all of those when we were doing stuff before. You, you picked up more. Yeah, but, but not that many. <laughs> I don't know. Here's a question for you. How often do you think you daydream? 24-7. That, you know, I was thinking that too, because I, even sometimes when we're sitting here, I'll be thinking about something else and, like, daydreaming. Yeah, I know. And, <laughs> and I was just wondering, like, is that normal? Like, how often do people daydream? Because I'm, like, constantly thinking about other stuff, you know? Yeah. I don't know. I don't, I, I don't, like, it's not daydreaming, like, impossible stuff. Like, I'm not like, I'm gonna go to Paris. I'm like, like, you know, I'm thinking about, like, oh, in, like, two hours, I'm gonna do this thing. Oh. I- Claymation is so creepy! There's very few Claymation that I can deal with. I have not seen that Claymation, the author of Tom Sawyer. I have not seen that. I have not seen that one. Uh, I don't mean daydreaming like that. I mean actually thinking of a story. Yeah, I mean, I used to do that all the time in school. Oh. You do it now? Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, I mean, obviously, while I was, like, driving, I was, like, daydreaming a lot, you know? Yeah, yeah. Well, that's why I think driving is a deceptively taxing thing, because you don't feel tired while you're doing it, but you are, like, in a low level, I'm paying attention all the time, which, mm. even if you're daydreaming, right, like, you, like, you can't really turn off your brain. At the moment in history, almost no one has the ability to not think of everything but what they're doing. What do you- do you mean, like, people can only focus on the one thing they're doing, or that they can't focus? Hmm. 
Yeah, yeah. There's too much access to things outside of you. Mm. Bro, that Rotom had an electric attack, too. All right, well, this plan was a failure. It's really just because these... The ma the water ones have a low speed stat. Mm. But this talon flame keeps roosting too. People can't even watch a 20, 20 minute video on social media. It's 90 seconds or less. Yes. Yeah, I definitely agree. And I definitely feel like there are a lot of days where I am definitely that person. Like, I get home from work and I'm just like, I can't concentrate on something longer than that. Yeah. Like, if yeah. I'm watching a TV show or something, that's different. But if I'm like on my phone. Yeah, I mean, I'm try. I try to make a conscious effort that, like, if you and I, if we're not just watching something on TV, but if we're like, I'm gonna watch a movie, I try to not look at my phone during the mm. movie. Okay, big boy. I would like you to stop using electric attacks. <coughs> uh, no I mean, what is the normal? Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, that's that's true. I don't know. I guess I was just curious uh, if anybody like I I literally like I will be multitasking, but I will just be daydreaming for a majority of the day, so... Um... Like, I don't know, I'm a very anxious person, so me doing stuff... like... like... keeps me... it keeps my brain from thinking about stuff that just doesn't help. Like, I'll just loop on toxic ideas. Yeah, that's not what I mean either. Uh, because like, yeah, I know, I know what you mean by daydream. Yeah, I like, yes, I daydream. I'm not daydreaming during this. Yeah, <laughs> we're essentially putting on a show, so I don't, you know, I'm <laughs> not a good show. Because, Ian's working right yeah. now. I'm just here. Yeah, you know, I don't know. Sometimes I feel like you could have a really good Pokemon stream, especially if you're very knowledgeable about Pokemon. I don't think the Pokemon games make for particularly enthralling viewing anymore. Hmm. Yeah. I feel like, I don't know, sometimes I will hyper fixate on stuff, but it's not like uh, every day, you know? It'll be like if I, like when I was playing Baldur's Gate, I'd be like, I need to play this like 10 hours a day kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. Not like I get distracted uh, kind of thing. So... I bet there's not like a water AoE attack or something. Yeah. I mean, that's one of the problems is they keep using... I was like, that Rotom is really the problem. So... Yeah. So the real problem is that Ogre Pond is under leveled. Mm. And then like, like um, I mean they're basically teaching you the meta of if you wanted to play like competitive online in this, right? Mm. Like having a support Pokemon. Yeah, oh yeah, because that, the internet is not, like, 
the, it, it's not a good space to have a conducive, complicated argument unless you're really trying to, you know, understand the person. He is an executor? Yeah. I did not remember that for the first fight at all. Oh. You're not really here. Ronnie's, Ronnie's uh, already in bed. She's daydreaming about being like... I'm already <laughs> thinking about sleeping. There he goes. Oh my god. Why? His speed stat is out of control. He lived. Please. He lived! He's gonna get these hyper beam on me, or solar beam. But yeah, that's why, like, Rodney and I, we try not to use social media that much. I actually deleted Facebook off my phone, because I was like, I, I don't even know why I would go on there. I don't even like Facebook. Yeah. I really just try to use Twitter for the podcast now. Yeah. So. I also think Twitter is the best place to go if you're looking for, like, new... Like, if you want news that's not from, um, like, you know public media. Like, something's happening somewhere in the world, you want to see what people are saying about it at that moment. I mean, honestly, Twitter, I just, that's where I find all the artists that I like, so... Like, yeah, Twitter's really cool, it just sucks that it's falling apart. Mm. Alright, progress has been made. Yep. Now this damn Blaziken's coming out, I think. And the mo Mag Mortar, yeah. The Blaziken's ability raises his speed stat, though, so if you can kill him fast enough, he's less of a problem. You know? He's gonna terrestrialize too. What does he terrestrialize into? No idea. I get him to flinch. I terrestrialize first. And also, social media has kind of killed... Um... Well, that's why I think, like, Rooters is really good. They did, uh, the Rooters... Or not Rooters. Rooters did the study. I can't remember what the heck the newspaper was. But they did a study for the least biased social media. Um... remember who it is. Um, but I like NPR, um, and then I read Le Monde, which, so I can get, like, news from outside of America about America. Oh, man. There we go. There we go. Something's happening now. But yeah, I mean, well, I don't know. I, I think it's wrong to say, like, I don't trust the news. What I'm- I'm always leery of the slant they have behind them, right? I think they're telling their version of the truth. Get him. Yeah, have a little snack. I was like, boo! There we go. Yep. We just gotta get through that early phase. Yeah, that Rotom is really... It's really annoying. <laughs> He's hiding behind his frying pan. I wanted to win, but I lost. Amazing writing right there. Yep. So coherent. Mm -hmm. Woo! That was amazing. We cranked the heat up all the way. I love battles and I love cooking because they're both so easy to understand. With cooking, your dish is either spicy or not spicy. Simple, right? But right now, the mood of the League Club feels off. I don't know, it's so frustrating. I wish I knew how we could go back to being the fun club we were before. But hey, 
Didn't mean to douse the flames there. You are real strong. Let me see if I can transfer the burning heat from our battle to my frying pan. I whip you up something great. <laughs> the oh, pictures wow. are real good. He cooks with the... The, the mag boiler. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know, people are going to use things for their own advantage. And that's one of my... Why I don't work in a public school, despite having a master's in education. <laughs> is a public school... Does not usually, if you have good teachers and the school kind of supports them, they can do it. But it doesn't teach critical thinking, right? Like, the, like all the skills you learn in school are useful, but they never think like they're they're to prepare you to get a job. They're not for you to be like, oh no, um, my car broke down. I have to change the oil. I can't afford to get my oil changed. And I really need my car tomorrow, right? Mm. Okay, go to the library. It'll be annoying, it'll take some time, and it'll be messy, but you can teach yourself how to do that, right? They're not about teaching yourself to solve a problem, mm -hmm. which is what bothers me the most about public school. He gave me one of his favorite moves. And I'm not saying it always has to be that, but that, like, I think if you are confident enough that you can solve a problem, or at least attempt to make progress, you're better off than if you knew how to do everything. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. You know, like, when, peop when people... They're, they're setting you up to work on the assembly line of capitalism. I've got no clue how to manage the temperature of anything besides what I'm cooking. So all I can say is crank up the heat all you want in the BB League, Ian. The BB League. Bye, Magwater. He's so slow. Chonky man. Yo, champ in the making. That's one Elite Four member beat. Things are looking good for you. Christmas no pushover. He's just super straightforward. I think that's kind of part of his charm, you know? We used to all chow down on Christmas cooking. Really? It seems like it only involves hot sauce. <laughs> Those were the days. Cassie's been worrying about the way things are too, in his own way. He just might be the one we need to shake things up in the league club. That's it for me. Good luck with the remaining Elite 3. <laughs> Thanks, bro.